It is a longtime tradition in Santa Fe, the burning of Sosobra. But will a new event ruin that decades long tradition? News 13's Chris McKee spoke to organizers about it. Yeah, Dean, the Zobra committee says it will burn Zobra's cousin, Tio Coco, in Fort Marcy Park next month. They call this burn a rare exception, but one with precedent. It's a Santa Fe icon. Tens of thousands see burn every single year. And while the yearly Zozobra everyone knows will burn again in August, before that happens, Zozobra organizers are planning to torch a different kind of Zozobra, and it's for a private crowd. This is an opportunity, a once in a lifetime opportunity. Zozobra chairman Ray Sandoval speaking to us on FaceTime says next month, Zozobra's 50 foot cousin named Tio Coco will light up in Fort Marcy Park for a special event paid for by the National Governors Association as part of its annual conference being hosted in Santa Fe. We just thought, what an honor for us to be able to do this and what a way to be able to share this. But some have questioned the upcoming event, saying Zozobra's creator, Will Schuster, specifically made the burning for the public for fiestas. I definitely understand that perspective. But Sandoval also points to Zozobra's history. In December 1940, Schuster was asked by Warner Brothers Studios to burn a Zozobra for the Santa Fe Trail movie premiere. It was a private party. Sandoval says that's when this Tio Coco was created and burnt for the Hollywood stars. He feels this year's private Tio Coco burning will be in the same spirit. This is an extreme circumstance, so uh, we don't plan on doing any more Tio Cocos for a very long time. Now, the conference for the governors is currently slated to go from July 19th through the 21st, but they don't know that exact date yet that Tio Coco will burn. Dean? All right, Chris, thank you. Organizers say they have been in touch with neighbors about this event, and they promise it will not draw anywhere near the 60,000 people who watched Sosobra burn last year.